two new comets are making their way into our skies. C2025 R2 Swan and C2025 A6 Lemon. On their own, each might seem like just another icy wanderer, but together they arrive with such peculiar timing that it feels like something more, almost like a celestial performance. Comet Swan, discovered on September 11th, 2025, is already stealing the spotlight. Its tail stretches about five full moon diameters across the sky, and under dark skies, you might soon glimpse it with your own eyes. Meanwhile, Lemon, discovered earlier this year, is brightening more gently. Its coma glows softly with hints of bluish gas tail, far less dramatic than Swan, but still a noticeable presence. And here's where it gets interesting. Both comets reach their closest approach to Earth almost back to back. On October 20th, 2025, Swan passes at about 0.26 astronomical unit, or 39 million kilometers. Then, on October 21st, Lemon follows at about 0.60 astronomical unit, or 89 million kilometers. Two cosmic visitors, one after the other, practically sharing the same stage. Events like this are exceptionally rare. While comets pass Earth regularly, having two brighten and reach their closest approach within a single day is almost unheard of in modern sky watching. But we are not done yet. Here's the real twist. At that exact time, our Interstellar Traveler 3i Atlas slips into a superior conjunction positioned on the far side of the Sun from Earth and completely hidden from view. It's the perfect act of misdirection. While our eyes are drawn to Swan's brilliant tail and Lemon's softer glow, Atlas just vanishes, like the hands of a master illusionist. One hand distracts, while the other conceals the real trick. And all of this happens on October 21st, which by the way is a new moon, give or take. Even more intriguing, Swan's orbit spans centuries, possibly 1400 years, though some estimate as long as 22,500 years. These vast cycles feel reminiscent of the ancient yoga cycles, sweeping ages of transformation and human evolution. If you've seen my earlier video on how we may have entered a new yoga age on March 21st, 2025, you'll understand why this timing feels uncanny. Perhaps comets like Swan and Lemon aren't just icy debris, but cosmic clock hands marking turning points in our story. History too whispers of such moments. Myths speak of long-tailed comets during times of upheaval. Even Graham Hancock's ancient apocalypse suggests the ancients watched the skies for omens, particularly around the end of the Younger Dryas, roughly 12,000 years ago. So here we are, two comets blazing, Swan with this spectacular tail, Lemon edging into visibility, and our interstellar visitor vanishing behind the sun. A cosmic sleight of hand. The question is, what's the trick? And are these comets the harbingers of a new age?